and I already created a folder and I'm about to save this inside of the folder so we'll call it video JS all right so to start the video stream we're gonna need a we're gonna need to make a server so to start that we'll just do the basic stuff you know require HTTP and we're going to need access to the file system so require file system all right so first we're going to start off the server with a console log that'll say server starting at local host and I'm going to use the port 3000 all right so first we're going to need to create a HTTP server so we just throw up a function and then put in a request parameter and a response parameter all right and we need to write to the browser the response that it's going to get which will be right head and the status code will be 200 and then content type inside of a JSON string would be content dash type would be slash video slash mp4 it depends on the file format i only tried it with mp4 so we're going to do var and we're going to create a variable for a read string so var rs equal to file system dot create read stream and then the read stream is going to grab the file. So I need a video. So let's grab a video. Do cat.mp4. Just download the file. Then I'm just going to throw it in my project and rename it to name it to cat. So then we're going to call it cat.mp4. And then from there, we're going to Type in response and then pipe and pipe and then response and then we need to make it listen. I need to make my server listen on a port. So we're just gonna get rid of all this. I don't need a callback right now. And then port three. Thousand. Then I can just start my server from right here, and then we're gonna go to localhost. Then colon three 
thousand. Oh. And as you <laughs> and as you can see, we created a video stream. And with the amazing dialogue. <laughs> Thanks.